<clears throat> just enjoy it. Enjoy the sound of the rain, the cars, the wind. Doesn't matter what you're doing. Doesn't matter what you're thinking. Just be here. Is there any reason for you to think what you're thinking? Breathe in real deep. Just do it. Can you find your heartbeat without touching yourself? Do you like your heartbeat? Have you had a really busy day? Even if you've done nothing, has your mind been racing? What do you think it's leading you away from? It's racing somewhere, isn't it? Don't overthink it. Find your heartbeat. If you get irritated or frustrated, it's totally okay. Just slow down. If you could feel any emotion right now, what would it be? Don't punish yourself if it's something negative. And don't feel great about yourself if it's something positive. Just be aware of what you would rather be feeling than what you're feeling right now. Now be honest with yourself, because whatever you had as an answer was a lie, and you and I both know that. Because you want something deeper and more meaningful than simply being happy, or wealthy, or bored, or neutral, or angry, or less sad. Find your heartbeat. What are you doing with your hands? I want you to hold your hands together, palm to palm, and rub them together for about 10 seconds. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, and back to one again. Do you feel that tingling in your palms? Hold your hands to your heart now while they're still tingly. And breathe in real deep. Now think these words are something along the lines of these words. I am breathing into my heart. You can say I am breathing love into my heart or I am breathing light into my heart. Or even, I am breathing joy into my heart. Pick an emotion or a state of being that is close to enlightenment. You can even say, I am breathing in enlightenment into my heart. And just breathe it back in there. Now I want you to imagine what it's like to be petting a animal companion, like a cat or a dog or a baby sheep or a, a bunny. How cute their faces look. How happy they are to see a human. How much they love that you touch them and you play with them. Now I want you to say that you are grateful for the love. I want you to feel that you're grateful and be aware of it. That that simple feeling of appreciation is your key. Rub your palms together again. One, two, three, four. Take a deep breath. Now hold your cheeks, your face, one palm on each cheek, and tell yourself that you are worth loving. Whenever your mind races, when you Notice yourself running after it to catch it. <clears throat> I'm asking you to do this very simple thing. Regardless of how dumb you feel doing it or how irrelevant it seems. Whenever you have a moment of panic or anxiety, frustration or restlessness, I want you to rub your hands together for as long as you want. And tell yourself something kind. Even something as simple as, I am simply kind. And just caress your face the way you would to one of those sweet, furry little animals. Pet your own face. Get that negative energy out of there and instead put positive energy in there. Get the anxiety out of your heart by rubbing your hands together and putting in positive energy there instead. Breathe into your heart and claim what you're breathing in.
All it takes is 10 seconds. When you're washing your hands, wash away the fear so that love can take its place. Wash away the lies. Wash away the gossip. Wash away the smoke and mirrors so the truth can take its place. Wash away the archons so that your own light can rule you instead of their darkness. When you're taking a shower, wash away the dust of all those days you cowered in fear because you didn't know what to do. You don't have to carry that around with you anymore. Let it go. I know that your mind makes things scarier than they are. But it's only because your mind is afraid too. And it wants your help. It's asking you to be in your heart and to lead your mind. Your mind isn't a leader. It's your, it's your tool. Your heart is your leader. You, yourself, the capacity to feel and to exist, that's you. The energy that mobilizes your body, that's you. The jitters, the goosebumps, the shivers, it's all you. Even the fear is you. And eventually you'll be able to embrace that fear with an open heart. But until then, calm yourself. And just listen. You are a really good person and you deserve to be happy. You deserve to live in a world where evil is nothing more than a faint memory. You deserve to be healthy. You deserve to be wealthy. You deserve to be a beacon of light. You deserve to be in love and to be loved. You deserve to sit there and do nothing if you want to. You are beyond worthy. You are so much more than worthy. If the word worthy isn't worthy of you, you are everything. And with your mind and your heart together, you can create anything. Have you ever held a pencil in your hand? The way the ridges feel, the cold feeling of wood and, and the colors they put on there. 
and the sound it makes on a piece of paper. The density of it, the weight of it, even the smell of a pencil. All those beautiful colors, they come in. If you had a pencil right now, what would you draw to help someone else smile? 